Today we're going to answer the myth. Are EVs a greater fire hazard than petrol and diesel cars? Well, of course not. It's a plain and simple myth. And in this video, I'm going to explain why. Hi, my name is Eric and welcome to Mythbusting with the Norwegian EV Association. When we look at the statistics from the real world, the numbers prove the opposite. EVs are not a greater fire hazard. In Norway, we have more than 650,000 EVs. More than one in five cars are already battery electric vehicles. In 2022, we had 753 car fires in Norway. With 20% of all cars being electric, how many of these fires were in EVs? 22. Yes, you heard right, 22 out of 753. That's under 3%. People tend to say that the battery is the dangerous part and that it will always burn if the car catches fire. However, EV batteries have extensive fireproofing to prevent this. When EVs do catch fire, it is most often in the same part of the vehicle as for petrol and diesel cars. The car battery seldomly catches fire. If the battery does catch fire, it can be a bit difficult to extinguish. But a fire service with the correct equipment and training, as in Norway, can handle fires in batteries without any major repercussions or harm. Typically, we also see the media has on numerous occasions falsely accused EVs of causing fires. A great example was after a large fire in a parking complex near Stavanger Airport in 2020. The media was quick to place the blame on an electric car. It was in fact a diesel car that caused the fire. Not only that, but the evaluation of the fire stated that EVs did not contribute to the fire development beyond what is expected from conventional vehicles. The fact is, EV car fires are far fewer than fires in petrol and diesel cars. And according to recent tests, if they do catch fire, it is controllable. Also, with the coming solid-state batteries, the fire risk will be even less. So, myth busted. The sources we have used are down in the comments. If you want more myth busting, please like and subscribe.